Okay, loves. So I'm going to do a mukbang. I'm not sure if it's mukbang or mukbang, but I got fries and I got six pieces miles away from Hooters. My friends give me like a list of questions that I should answer. I don't like mustard at all. So, we're not away. Mayo. So the first question is, this has a hundred questions. So the first question is, are you a morning or a night person? I'm a night person. I, it's hard for me to wake up early in the morning. Probably because I stay up late at night in the first place, but I'm a night person. Are you afraid of the dark? <laughs> no, I'm not afraid of the dark. But I remember when I was younger, we used to stay in Orlando. It's not really Orlando, but if I see the place, most people don't even know where that is. But if I see Orlando, they know. It's called, it's in Claremont, around Mineola. And sometimes I used to be the last one to stay up from watching TV and I used to just turn off the light and just run to the bedroom and get under the covers. So I'm not afraid of the dark. Are you an extrovert or an introvert? I am an introvert. My Myers-Briggs personality it's INFJ, so I'm introverted. Are you double jointed? No, I'm not double jointed. Are you left or right handed? I am right handed. I can write with my left hand, but I'm right handed. Are you more of a tidy or a messy person? Um, I like things to be organized, so I'm pretty tidy, but you know. Are you always late or on time? Are you on time or always late? I feel like you can't really fall into either one because not everybody's always late, not everybody's always on time. Things happen, but I'm usually on time. I remembered for a audition that I had for the Oprah Winfrey Network and I was about an hour earlier. <laughs> And the lady that was there, she told me she's going to try to get me in early, but I told me that's okay. I was here early. Are you ticklish? I am very ticklish. Very, very ticklish. Can you curl your tongue? Um, yeah. Can you ice skate? No, I can't ice skate, but I've always wanted to. I thought it was, it looked very fun.
Can you wiggle your ears? Coffee or tea? Neither. I don't like coffee, nor do I like tea, but I do like iced tea. I drink it sometimes. I don't like coffee or tea. Cookie cake or donuts? I would have to go with donuts. A chocolate frosted donut. Did you ever participate in a talent show? Not that I know of, but I have been in shows, just not talent shows. Did you go to prom? Yes, I did. Do you like school? I like my school in New York, but I'm not sure if this is high school or college, but I do like school in general. I like to learn new things. You never stop learning. Do you believe in ghosts? kind of creepy to feel like there's probably somebody behind me right now. <laughs> Do you bite your nails? Now I don't bite my nails. And I remember when I was younger, I think I used to bite my nails. Do you consider yourself a good cook? I think anybody who's been asked that question, they're probably going to say they are a good cook. But I do know how to cook. I do love cooking. I don't do it much. But of course, obviously I'm a good cook. Do you enjoy dancing? Yes, I do. Do you enjoy DIY or crafts? Yes, I do. Do you forgive easily? I do forgive. But even if I forgive, it's, I forgive, but I never forget what the person did. I think it's pretty hard to forget if somebody ever hurt you or anything like that. But I do feel like forgiveness doesn't necessarily do anything for the other person. They just know they have it. But I feel like forgiveness only frees you, you know, you as in the person who forgives. So, yeah. But I do forget, yes. Do you have nicknames? Yes, I do. I have quite a few, actually. I have Teto, I have Cece, I have Frenchie, and I have Chrissy. <laughs> Each has their own backstory. <laughs> Do you have any allergies? Not that I know of, no. Do you have any phobias? I used to think that I was afraid of height till about a, a month ago. I was having this conversation with my friend and I thought, you know, I've been to a lot of pretty high places, so I'm not really afraid of heights, but I'm afraid of falling from a high place. So I guess a phobia of falling from a high place, if that's even a thing. But there are many phobias out there, so. Who knows? Do you have any piercings or tattoos? 
No, I do not. Do you have children? No, I do not. Do you have pets? Not necessarily on my own. My cousin has a pet named Casey. Um, I love her. So, yeah. Do you have siblings? Yes, I do. Do you prefer dog or cats? I prefer dog. I've always wanted a white husky with blue eyes. That's like my dream pet right there. Excuse me. Do you prefer Mac or PC? Um, I've been using PC for a long time, as long as I can remember. But I recently just got a Mac, so it's probably going to take me a while to see which side I'm really on. So far, I'm towards the PC, but I haven't been using the Mac much to know if I like it or not. I recently got it. Do you prefer beach or the mountains? I would love to go hiking, so I'm probably going to pick the mountains. Do you prefer bath or shower? I do love bubble baths, but I feel like they're, they're a bit time consuming, I guess you could say. Not really time consuming, but, you know, it's not, I feel like it's not something you do every day, but I do love bubble baths. But I would probably go with shower. Yeah. Do you sing in the shower? I do. I actually have a playlist, a shower playlist on my phone that I put on every time I go to shower. So. Do you smoke? No, I do not. Do you speak any different languages? Yes, I do. Do you still have your wisdom tooth? I have three, two on top and one on this side. This one right here, I had to take it out because around 2015, 2016, the end of 2015, um, it was hurting me a lot, so I had to take it off to take it out. My dentist actually told me that I came at the right time because, you know, it could go to your bloodstream and stuff like that. So I had to take it out. It was very painful. But I still have three more. So. Okay. Do you still watch cartoons? No, not really. Did you or have you played any sports? Yes, I do. Does your name have special meaning? I don't know. Every time I tell somebody my name, they're usually like, oh, like the champagne. And I'm usually like, yeah, it's the champagne. Have you ever been hospitalized? Yes, I have. Have you ever been on a diet? I don't think so. I have been, you know, on a healthy, healthy meal plan before. Have you ever been to a concert? No, I have not, but I would love to go to one. I'm planning on going to one when I have time. So. Have you ever gone camping? No, I have not. But I would love to go. Have you ever met any celebrities? I've seen Trey songs. Oh, actually, speaking of concert, he did have a little concert on Grad Bash when I went to Grad Bash. So I guess that does fall on their concert. So I guess I have been to one. But it was for Grad Bash and he was performing. So have you ever skipped class? Yes, I have.
Have you ever worn something? Yes, I have. Have you had any braces? No, I have not. How are you feeling right now? I feel fine. Food always makes people feel great. Um, I love food. How tall are you? My license is 5'5". Five five. So. <laughs> but, I don't know. I went to get my license. And they asked me. I wasn't sure. I think I just said 5'5". Five five. <laughs> yeah. If money were no object, what would you get for your next birthday? Um, hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe a cruise or, I don't know. Or a ticket somewhere around the world. I don't know. If you could live anywhere in the world, where would it be? Maybe Paris. Yeah, Paris. Have you ever, were you ever a scout or a brownie? When I was younger, a little bit younger, I was an adventurous in church. So, I don't know, maybe that's something similar to it. I have gone to sell cookies before from door to door and sell stuff for fundraising in school. Like when we have sports or something that we have to play for, to pay for. But to actually be in a Girl Scout, Scout, I don't think I have. Come on, I can't talk. I cannot talk today, so I don't know what's going on. What did you eat last? Well, I can't say Hooters because I'm eating Hooters right now. So the last thing I ate... Was it Chipotle? No, the last thing I ate was Chick-fil-A. Yeah, Chick-fil-A. What city were you born in? I forgot how you pronounce it. I think it's called Jeremiah. Or I, I totally forgot how you pronounce it. Jeremiah. Did you ever want, what did you want to be when you were younger? Well, when I was younger, I wanted to be a model, and then I changed my mind. I wanted to be a doctor as I was growing up, but when I was younger, younger, I wanted to be a model. Yeah. What do you do on a typical Friday night? I usually stay in on a typical Friday night. Yeah, I usually stay in. What's Watch a movie on Netflix and because on Friday night the market is closed so I'm not trading or anything like that. So, yeah. What is one food that, one food that you refuse to eat? Thank you.
There's like this Haitian meal. I'm not really sure what they call it. It's like in between grits. It's not grits, but it's like grits and it's like corn. It's like in between grits and corn. I totally forgot how you call it, but I don't like it at all. Um, yeah. What is one item on your bucket list? Oh, that's 20 minutes. I have my 20 minutes mark because I wanted to do this video for 20 minutes. Um, but one thing on my bucket list is to travel the world, actually. And, yeah. Alright. So I did not finish this bucket game because I don't want the video to be longer than 20 minutes. But... I definitely will do a part two of the questions because this had a hundred questions and right now I am on question 59 so one more video will hook it up so bye loves um enjoy your days and I will see you on my next video